What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Hannah. As always, be sure to click that subscribe button down below and give this video a thumbs up. I'm really proud of myself because I've been vlogging a lot more and I hope you guys have been enjoying the content. I'm super excited to have a new intro and kind of really embracing this whole new chapter here in New York. It is Friday night and as I'm sure you can tell, from my outfit and makeup and hair and everything. I'm going out tonight with my roommate, Kara. We are going to this bar because I went on a date with this guy last week and he has a friend who was DJing at a bar near us and he invited us to come. We are gonna see how it goes, but we listened to some of the music and it sounds like it's gonna be a really good time, so we're excited. Kara, come say hi. Hello. Finally making her grand, like you, you've been in clips so she you've never like spoken or said anything. But she's here, she's leaving me next week to go to Vegas. The <laughs> last minute trip. <laughs> last minute trip to go to Vegas, which I'm very sad about. But I'll be back for the weekend. Yeah, she'll be back next weekend. So we are going to have a fun little roomy weekend. This weekend, tomorrow is the UGA Auburn game, which is gonna be really exciting. And yeah, we're just gonna have a really fun week plan. Our friend Allie is out of town. So is our friend Alyssa. So a lot of our friends are kind of all over the place. So it's just gonna be me and Cara mostly, but our friend Mila is having a rooftop party tomorrow at her apartment. So we're gonna go do that. And then during the day, we are gonna do a bottomless brunch, kind of hang out, get some stuff situated. So yeah, it's gonna be another really great weekend here in New York City. Um, yeah, let's see what happens tonight. I will keep you guys updated. Um, so Kara's drink of choice is now a triple shot espresso <laughs> uh, from Starbucks. So she won't fall asleep. <laughs> she likes to make her uh, at home so espresso her. martinis. We have some oh, lovely Tito's that's yep. probably gonna make me gag, but that's fine. I have my laundry in a pile on the couch back there. And yeah, oh my God, wait, show them your fit. Oh my God, so cute. Cool. Are Steve Madden. Yeah, very cute. Very, she just got those. Forever 21. This is really old for Forever 21. All black, like usual. All black, like usual. Yeah. All right, let's take this shot. Give the people what they want. What a banger, honestly. Okay. All right, ladies and gents, you know the drill. Quick fit check before I leave. Jeans are my all-time fave. Asymmetrical jeans from Princess Polly. Bodysuit is also from Princess Polly. Necklace is Jewels by Jessica. And then my shoes are these little pointed booties from ASOS. So yeah, this is tonight's fit. Going to have a great Friday night. Let's do it. Hi. Good morning. Well, good afternoon at this point. Um, I am unwell. And uh, <laughs> we had quite the night last night. We went to this bar called The 13 Step in the East Village. And it was really fun. The DJ was really good. And then, yeah, I kind of just went to like another bar around there. I did not go to sleep until like 3 a.m. and I am very tired. Um, but we had a good time. The plan today is to go to brunch, bottomless as always. And then we are going to go and watch the UGA game. And then our friend Mila is having a party tonight. So, that is going to be a lot of fun. I had quite the night because I broke both of my uh, nails. That's how you know it was a good night. But yeah, this is a rough morning, but we're hanging in there. I desperately need coffee. So I think first things first is I'm going to go and grab that. And then I kind of need to hurry and get ready because where we're going is like not 
far, but it's not like walking distance either. We're probably gonna have to subway there. We're going to brunch at the Horny Ram. Um, I can't believe that's actually the name, but it is. And apparently it's really good. And yeah, I need coffee and a Bloody Mary. So that's where I'm at currently. All right, picked up an iced hazelnut oat milk latte from this place around the corner for me and Cara. God, our apartment is a mess currently. Playing some music on the TV. Cara <laughs> is getting ready. It is game day. We are going to have a great day. Okay, so my life is slightly more together now and I'm looking a lot better and way more put together. Um, but yeah, I picked Cara and I up coffee and I just got ready kind of quickly. I'll show you guys my outfit here in a minute. We just called an Uber and are about to head to the Horny Ram for brunch. The weather is pretty overcast, which kind of sucks, but good day to go and have brunch drink some Bloody Marys, watch some football. So that's kind of our plan for this afternoon. We're probably gonna come back here and regroup and then go to this party later tonight. So yeah, I'll show you guys my fit really quickly. Also, I've been wearing the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk lipstick and lip liner recently, pretty much anytime I go out or do my makeup and I really love it. I love this shade on. I almost got the darker shade, but this is just the original, and I think it just looks really good with my complexion, and it's just kind of like a nice pinkish nude. Um, didn't do my hair, but it's still got some style to it from last night, so I will show you guys my outfit really quickly, and then we're gonna head out. So this is the fit for today. This little sheer top is from Zara leather overshirt that I've been wearing literally every weekend is also from Zara black leather pants are my go-to faves pretty sure I wore these in last weekend's vlog too these are nasty gal and then of course my Jordan high tops obsessed with them it's not very game day I mean I guess it kind of is but um just gonna go with it kind of just threw this together but I'm feeling the look. I like it. So this is the look we're going for today. Hello everyone. So it is almost seven o'clock. Kara and I are about to go to the DL rooftop for a little bit because there is an event happening there and some people that I know there. So we are gonna go and check that out. Um, we went to the Horny Ram for brunch, which was actually really good. Good service too, like the waiters were really nice. Got a bottomless brunch. I had um, Eggs Benedict, Kara had Huevos Rancheros and we got to watch like the first half of the game. Then we decided that we wanted to come back for a little bit because Kara actually had a package that she wanted to check on because unfortunately, people keep stealing our freaking packages in our building and Kara ordered this shirt. She wanted to make sure no one stole it. So we came home, showed them the shirt. Yay! Yay! Okay, so it's a Travis Scott t-shirt. It's like a fragment collab. It looks shirt. so sick. So Thank luckily, God. no Thank one God. stole it. So she was able to come back and get the shirt. And then we just kind of hung out. I made some TikToks. Now we're drinking, about to go to this rooftop. And then we're gonna go to our friend's party tonight. So it has been a very packed day. Um, uh, but yeah, it's been good so far. I'm drinking um, the Lunar Hard Seltzer. Technically, Austin bought this last weekend and he didn't drink it, so now I'm drinking it for him. Um, so shout out Austin, this is the plum flavor. Apparently they're really big on TikTok or that's at least how he heard of them and it's really good. Um, so yeah, drinking this. Kara was sleeping per usual. Yes. Um, so I just kind of entertained myself, but now we're gonna take maybe like a shot or two and then go back out. So, wish us luck. Refreshing. Okay, so we 
are about to go to our friend Mila's party. We went to that rooftop party at the DL, um, like right near us in the Lower East Side, and it was fun. It was definitely not worth having to pay admission, which we did, but it was fun to go to for a little bit, and then we came back here and just hung out some. FaceTime my friend Jessica. Jessica, if you were watching this, I miss you so much, and I'm so excited for you to come and visit New York, and I cannot wait to see you soon. Kara and I drank a little bit more. We were about to leave and go to the party. Still wearing the same outfit that I've been wearing all day. So that's how you know it's real when you haven't even had time to change. <laughs> Hello guys, so it is a little bit after midnight. I still have my makeup on obviously so I thought I'd do a little quick get on ready with me and I guess show you guys more of like my nighttime skincare routine. First things first, tried and true Neutrogena makeup removers. Um, I know these things are probably not the best thing for my skin but they get the job done so going to be using those but yeah I guess let's talk a little bit about my life and how some of these dates well I say plural dates but really it was just one date let's kind of talk about how that went for me last week I guess um but yeah, the date went well. I mean, clearly it went well enough for me to meet up with the guy last night. Um, and we hung out with his friends and they were all really nice too. Um, so that's good. I mean, I feel like that's always like a really big indicator is that not only if like the guy seems normal, but also like if his friends seem normal too and i like had a lot of really good friendships flourish from my last relationship that that's kind of like now a factor for me is thinking like oh okay like do i actually see myself like hanging out with these like people and they were all really nice not saying that i think this guy is going to be my boyfriend. I do think that there might be another date in our future, but I'm trying to be smarter about thinking like critically like, okay, do I actually see this going somewhere? Because I don't want to waste my time and I don't want to waste the guy's time. Makeup is off. Now I'm going to use this new cleanser that I've been using, which is the CeraVe Renewing SA cleanser. I believe SA stands for salicylic acid. Um, but it's supposed to be really good about like gently exfoliating and smoothing your smoothening your skin, which is really important to me because I don't really have like acne, but I do have just like uneven texture. And so I'm trying to do a better job of like clearing that. So I've been using this for the last few days and I like it so far. So okay just washed that. I'm out of moisturizer, so I'm going to steal some of Cara's moisturizer. Stole some of her moisturizer. Pretty sure this is just like CeraVe or CeraVe, however you say it. Just like everyday moisturizer. Nothing special. Um, but yeah, on another note, the dogs won, which is amazing. As they should have they should have won they definitely did car and I watched like the beginning of the game and then we intended to watch the second half of the game and we didn't but like the first half of the game was kind of nerve-wracking because like I don't feel like UGA was playing as well as they like should have been necessarily but they turned it around which is really amazing because obviously we beat Auburn which is like one of probably I'd say our biggest rivals definitely like one of our longest rivals and then we're ranked number two but then Alabama that's ranked number one ended up like unexpectedly losing to Texas A&M which is wild maybe not Texas A&M it's either like UT or Texas A&M I think it's Texas A&M don't quote me on that 
they ended up losing which is great for us because now UGA is ranked number one as we should be which is so awesome like I can't remember the last time we were ranked number one so last thing I do is I finish off with the Sunday Riley Luna sleeping night oil I'm basically like out of this stuff like very much out of it as you can see I have like none left I'm going to try and get some out oh I think I got some yeah perfect okay so it has like this little applicator just like put a couple drops in my hand throw it in my hands and then rub it in my skin that was a nice little chit chat um get unready with me slash get ready with me for bed so i'm about to go to sleep and i will see you guys in the morning good morning guys well it's almost noon so i guess almost good afternoon it is sunday and i can definitely say that waking up on a sunday not hungover is a glorious feeling um so yeah not a lot planned for today i have some work that i need to do cara and i really want to watch the kim kardashian snl episode that aired last night so we're gonna try and find that and watch that today i have some work that i need to do a youtube video that i need to edit that will hopefully already be uploaded by the time this video goes up and yeah just some like general cleaning things um i kind of need to go to the grocery store but going to trader joe's on a sunday is my own personal version of hell so I might just do that tomorrow um but i don't have a lot of food here dilemma but yeah not a lot planned for today going to have just a chill sunday it's also overcast and kind of gloomy so i feel very much inclined to just kind of stay in bed and watch netflix all day but we will see what ends up happening classic breakfast as always this has been in literally every single one of my vlogs for the last three weeks but what can I say? I love it. Kara and I are about to watch the Kim Kardashian SNL episode, which we're really excited about. Kara, do you want to say good morning to the vlog? Morning. <laughs> I have to change my water and my flowers. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be looking real rough right about now, but I just went to Sephora to pick up a few products actually i'll show you guys really quickly one sec the peace out acne acne healing dots are great when you have a zit you put it on at night before you go to bed wake up the next morning and it's basically gone i love using these and then i also just picked up like the it's the call it a night little to-go kit from drunk elephant Honestly, just because I needed moisturizer and I typically use the Inky List moisturizer from Sephora that's like $14 and like a really affordable dupe for the like polypeptide moisturizer from Drunk Elephant. I believe that's what it's called. Um, but they were sold out of it and I really needed moisturizer. So I just got this little like to go like travel size one just to hold me over until I'm able to find a location that has it. And then I picked up some sushi Kara is going to target right now going to probably watch a movie now and get some work done or at least try to get some work done i'm just feeling so unmotivated on this sunday but yeah that's kind of where i'm at it's like a little after 3 30 right now so i'm going to eat all of this amazing sushi because I'm very hungry and then kind of see where I'm, I'm at after that. Okay, so it is a little bit after 10. Did not vlog at all much this afternoon because didn't really do anything other than sit on my couch, but I wanted to show you guys. I just added in these cute little floating shelves 
on this side of my bed right here and I just have like a candle and a couple of picture frames right now I might get like a vase or something to put on one of the shelves so I have that over there now and then I moved this photo to this side right here over my bedside table um so yeah I finally feel like it's pretty much like all sort of come together at this point this has been my outfit of the day showered did my whole skincare routine um but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video another weekend in my life once again comment down below and like give me suggestions for like other video ideas I hope you guys are enjoying these videos I enjoy filming them and putting them together but I want to make sure you guys are getting content from me that you enjoy and I don't want to be like super repetitive but let me know your thoughts in the comments down below I hope you guys enjoyed this video as always thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys again next time.